Hey everyone, this is Scott Berry with Roland US. I uh, just thought I'd show you something really, really cool. I got a call last week on uh, can you hook up two MX1s? Well, guess what? You can. Uh, what you need to do is you need to come out the computer port, uh, the PC port that's on the uh, slave unit. Plug that up. Go ahead and plug that into uh, Aerolink. I've got this one in four. And then you just need to sync uh, the PC. Once the PC's sunk, I guess, would be the correct term, uh, then it will lock up and the, the first module will, will control the second unit, which is really cool. But anyways, I'll just kind of show you what I got going on. It's really basic. Uh, maybe it will inspire some of you to try some things different. Uh, if you've got a buddy with an MX-1, maybe you can put the two together, or if you've ever thought about getting another one, uh, go for it. Um, up here, I've got the JDXI running also into the secondary unit. Uh, I've got a sequence of uh, bass track and uh, strings, but I've also got the JP08 running apart. And what's interesting is that the JP08 is actually on MIDI channel 5, meaning that the uh, JDXI can hear all 16 channels. It can also record. Now, you can't edit the other ones other than what's sitting in here, but it does kind of open up some other things, and uh, I think it's really, really cool. Anyways, I'll just kind of show you what I got going on and how I'm running different effects on this side compared to this one and do the best I can with one hand. So uh, here we go. Hopefully that was cool. Talk to you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Take care.